Hello tribe, welcome back to my channel and I'm putting one more 7 to 10 days predictions uh, reading for you guys. I am aware that I'm one day late. It's purely because I had to concentrate on myself this week and do a lot of self-care. Okay, so for pile number one, whoever is new by the way, we are picking from my intuitive deck. So that's for pile number one people. Now for pile number two, we have this card over here. For pile number three, this card. For pile number four, we have this intuitive card here. So take a pick. If you need some more time, stop the video guys and I'm going to catch you in timestamps. Hello tribe, whoever has chosen the first intuitive card over here, we're starting with your reading. And today I would like to start with your energies right now. So we're going to be pulling from the Starseed Oracle. And um, I just kind of want to tune into your energies and start from there. So let's see how you're feeling now, guys. What's up? What's up with you? Okay, and I'm gonna pull one more card from the Triple Goddess Tarot, this deck. Let's see, okay, one second, cards are all over the place. So for your oracle, you have none of, none of this matters, zoom out, common ground. So we're gonna tune into this and see what this is talking about. This card wants to come up. okay so what we have here guys for you pile number one uh, the perspective card this is saying hey zoom 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 out in order to start seeing the whole picture okay when it comes to whatever situation I'll be a bit abstract so that I don't put you guys in a box here this is saying zoom out and look at that earth over there from a very far far perspective okay because it seems like you might be you might be in this situation you might be invested in this situation too much therefore you you might not see everything clearly and for some of you i just want to put out you might be feeling um, you might be going for a period of darkness together with this card over here there is something that has happened maybe in your home something that has happened maybe around you that made you feel like you know what maybe it's my time to go or someone left i'm hearing okay so one or another so there is some kind of situation that you're dealing with here that made you really upset okay and made you i feel like you might have felt alone or left out okay and but it seems like guys for you you are on to a new adventure whatever has happened in the past you are on to a new adventure this is saying now it's time to go on your own now it's time to go and explore the world yourself and whatever the change that happened for you it has put you in a different in a different vibration even i'm hearing setting myself free whatever it means to you now okay and then we have six of wands which i love 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 and this is talking about you really walking towards to look how this is happening right really walking towards to this happiness of yours really walking towards to something that uh, you want to be successful in is it family life is it children do you like to connect with children do children make you happy um the innocence of theirs there is the happiness that you seek in here and the success is very much connected to some kind of change it can be movement as well and it's uh, very much to do with really being surrounded by things that are innocent for you would it be animals would it be children would it be um, I don't know going and visiting maybe a place I'm here in church even for some of you 
a gig of some sort it's something about this innocence for you that you have to tune into because once you change your perspective about whatever has happened in the past is the moment when you start working on your own and that working on your own is very powerful here because it seems like you are on to exploring your own calling of some sorts so let's take a look at your cards here when it comes to the next seven to ten days from whenever you're watching this video here okay okay let's see what you'll be dealing with I'm not taking reversals, okay? I have temperance. You've got eight of pentacles, okay? You've got the tower. You've got creativity. And I'm also gonna be pulling from my envelopes. <laughs> and uh, let's see what this will be telling us. What are you going to be dealing with? I'm gonna shuffle it in the most ridiculous way so that <laughs> that they will start flying all over the place. Okay, that one wants to come out. Let's take that one. We have travel, okay? And that one wants to come out. Mistake. So, okay, we're gonna take a look at that mistake and see what that's talking about for you. I feel like I want at least one more. And we have message. And I'm gonna pull one more from the tea leaf towel. So let's see what we have at the bottom. We have dark woman. It says dealings or relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. And one more. And we have the parrot. It says someone will gossip about all your secrets. So we can see where this mistake is coming from already, but I would like to concentrate on some other things before we start talking about it. So I'm going to put this on the side. And let's see what we have here. So you'll be seeking for balance and you might be like, oh, of course, I'm seeking for balance every single day, right? Um, you guys might be dealing with Sag, you might be dealing with an earth or fire sign here. I don't know why I want to put this out. I don't usually go by that, but maybe some of you that will be important. Now I'm paying attention to the snakes, to the snakes over here. Okay. And what this is telling me, you will be very much concentrated on something that, that heals you. So the healing will be very intense and you know you keep hearing healing and healing and healing from everyone right but whatever this healing is for you it seems like that healing is connected to your work somehow some kind of achievement that will heal your soul i'm hearing okay whatever the achievement or whatever you will be happy about the seven to ten to ten days from now it's connected to hard work but hard work not in a sense that you'll have to bust your ass off it's more to do with you being very consistent when it comes to work and you are given those rewards i do see you being at peace when it comes to what you're trying to achieve work wise okay so let's take a look at this tower here we have page of wands and we have the tower and this tower is a bit different here for me at least whatever the situation especially those who are planning some kind of travel okay this is saying hey uh maybe leave leave a little bit earlier if you try if you are going to be traveling um give yourself a little bit more time for some others of you this is saying check out the information so something if those for for only those who are traveling here okay this is saying uh, check the information out maybe if you are very excited about one part of that travel of some sorts make sure that you do have clear communication when it comes to people involved in it because i feel like you might miss some kind of message okay or you might miss some kind of information that you're not fully aware of and you might be like damn it i shouldn't have made this mistake i should have double checked my documents i should have double checked this and that okay so tower is not uh, intense here don't worry about that this is saying just make sure whatever um, the excitement you have the next week when it comes to your plans double check everything so that it goes smoothly for you 
Let's see what else we have here. We have two Eight of Pentacles from two different decks. I love this energy, really. And Magician, guys, your work will be amazing next seven to 10 days from now. So watch, you might start getting money and I'm looking at this dark haired woman and I feel like these two are connected. You might start receiving money for those especially who do have your own businesses. It's gonna be on point. You'll have a lot of customers coming to you for help. Uh, for services it's going to be a really really great week when it comes to this especially this dark hair wo haired woman will be very important when it comes to work now for a lot of you i'm getting that this is you who is dark hair woman watching this video now for others of you this is you male dark haired male who's watching this video okay because i feel like this is you really manifesting things that you have you have been waiting for so pay attention to things coming to you much quicker seven to ten days from now um look out for people sending you messages appreciating you okay i feel like i want one more envelope let's see what this one is and something that's going to be happening winter time or if you have any plans when it comes to winter time or snow i'm seeing maybe you from the place where it tends to get very cold uh, winter times it's going to be a very important time let's see what this is talking about we have older woman dealings or relationship with an older woman so something will happen or something has happened already when it comes to this older woman for you guys okay and let me see what that's talking about we have security This older woman is very important to you guys, by the way. We have imagination. So take advice when it comes to this older woman, especially if you'll be talking with her about some kind of plans winter time, or if you've done something with her winter time, or something significant has happened, okay? Because it seems like this woman somehow will be also influential when it comes to your security. We have security again. So you guys, pile number one, are very concentrated on your money on your foundation you are rebuilding it but with such power you have a lot of imagination you have literally ideas come into your mind non-stop now one thing what to watch out for whatever the ideas you have don't tell it to every single person okay because you don't need that keep some things for yourself because People will talk about great things that you are planning to do or great things that you have ideas about. So I would say save those precious ideas for yourself and only, sh only share those ideas with people who are very dear to your heart, okay? Let's see what kind of person will be important to you when it comes to these days, apart from the female that we keep getting here, okay? So for some of you that can be this older female, for some of you dark hair female, but the feminine energy is very strong here. Anyhow, let me see how, who is going to be the person who will be influential to you, for you, during these seven to 10 days from whenever you're watching this video. Again, pentacles, seven of pentacles, okay. Ace of cups. Someone at work. Someone at work, um, who does tend to think before acting, okay? And I feel like you are already or you were in some kind of collaboration or you shared your ideas with one another. Even if you're not working with this person, you had shared ideas before. And it seems like you might, both of you might come up with some kind of, kind of realization or idea of some sorts that will make both of you feel very excited you're like oh my god how how didn't we think about this before and we've been looking for such ideas for some time now and now bang we're gonna collaborate together so collaboration is really strong here another magician <laughs> guys uh, this is your week when it comes to manifestation so please use this time wisely whatever the ideas you have whatever urges you will be having this is saying Take this time to create this security for yourself and take this time to 
really appreciate the abundance that you will be getting and it's all connected with money it's all connected with i'm hearing inheritance of some sorts inheritance will be strong to you guys um it's going to be very it's like you, you restarting your life when it comes to your foundations here i don't know what has happened in the past but it has happened um for a reason when it comes to shifting you to a completely different person i'm hearing a lot of you will be growing up in a way i mean i'm not saying that you're not grown up but in the way that you will be taking your life much more seriously especially your wealth especially your work collaborations your finances you'll be planning everything out for your own future because it feels like you're like i need to start literally getting that pentacle for myself and the moment you will a lot of you are already is when you'll start seeing this flow of money or opportunities coming your way and you'll be like what the hell is going on now like it all comes to me at once so let me see your energy when it comes to your soul vibration during this time and we're pulling from the Stasi oracle again i really really love your pile number one i'm so proud of you i don't know you but whoever you are get that pentacle man seriously uh, write down those ideas ideas will be precious collaborations will be great opportunities will be brilliant so take that time to really build those foundations or keep building that building that you're building for yourself a castle some of you right let me see sorry guys near knocked down the camera i love this card it says activated earth power places power places ley lines trust where you are led look how similar these two are aren't they aren't they so trust where you are led guys walk through that gate this is a magical time for you you're gonna have that magical time for yourself this week walk through that gate take those new opportunities i'm hearing soak in life soak in everything that's coming fresh and new to you you might see a lot of orbs or you might start seeing flashes of light or you might have very weird sensations for some of you don't be afraid because you might be seeing an angel in your dream state or um i'm hearing when someone will be in the kitchen or living room you know when you will turn your head to, to one side maybe that's very specific for one of you you might see that so don't be afraid this is saying this is your spirit guide saying we're with you those who have who know that you have a person next to you watching over you that's going to be them sending you all those messages so please pay attention because someone or something is helping you manifest the f out of life okay so best of luck pile number one and i'm gonna catch you next time bye for now Hello pile number two people, whoever has picked this intuitive card over here, we're starting with your reading. So let me tune into, actually this week I'm doing it a bit differently because I really want to tune into your current energies and start from there. So let's, okay, that's what we have from the very beginning. I was about to say, let's pull an oracle card for you and see what's up. Or I think I want to pull from this deck too so let's start let's see what you're dealing with okay so let me show you we have you are not alone isolation physical connection community whoa look what we have here doesn't matter female or male in this case Whatever has happened to you here, whatever has bruised you, okay, what, whatever has happened in your life that made you feel like you can't handle it anymore or I keep working, working and things are not getting better or something has happened that you got hurt badly, okay? Even I'm feeling, even if it was like a physical, um, emotional hurt, it bruised you very badly here in the past, right? This is saying, look, 
you are not alone isolation you might feel like you are isolated or you have decided to isolate from from the world right now it says physical connection community and whatever the physical connection you have here i don't think all of you understand how impactful one person is in your life you do telepathically connect to someone but it's not only telepathy guys uh, this is beyond telepathy this is actually feeling each other to the level of emotional blockages of what how this person is feeling at this very moment what they doing whatever this connection is it seems like look at this it's one of the most powerful connections ever and this is closely connected to this uh, queen so whoever this person is would it be king of or queen doesn't matter okay this is someone who's super creative someone who works on their craft and they put all their heart in this craft now for some of you this might be representing you as well but whatever the case this is saying look you have this unimaginable be beyond this earth connection with someone you are not alone you are being looked after by the person who is very much in tune with your vibration okay now for some of you we have the justice here and this is saying you're gonna be you are seeking balance right now but i feel like you will be during these seven to ten days too i keep looking at the sword this is all about um speaking your truth and being balanced okay and how can you express yourself in the moment of difficult times to the world that is fair that is fair for you that is fair for for someone else and this is saying you need to understand right now that you're not alone i keep hearing not you're not alone oh my god i just heard the song one second i'm gonna have to find it give me one second guys i'm pretty sure i know the name of it but i just want to be sure that one second guys mm okay got it so it's called it's by michael jackson actually and it's called whatever happens where i think he starts singing the song you are not alone if i'm mistaken these these songs let me know but whatever happens song is very important song for you here i feel like you're gonna pick up a lot of messages when it comes to your current state um I think he says whatever happens don't let go of my hand and it's literally how this image is portrayed over here so maybe read the lyrics if you don't like the, the song or you don't like the artist okay or just listen to the song so someone really needs to hear that right now so let's start with your seven to ten days prediction okay let's see what you're dealing with and I'm being pulled to draw a couple of ooh, the envelopes for you and see what you will be dealing with. These, are, these have like quick messages in them. Okay, these. Let's see what we have. We have be assertive. Okay, that's beautiful. We have illusion. We're going to double check what these mean with tarot. And we have sell doubt. Okay, these two go very well together, don't they? This is saying whatever the self-doubt is your own illusion, okay? You kick ass, be assertive. This is very straightforward. Whatever you are wondering about right now when you're watching this video, this is saying you have created too many illusions in your own head. So let's see what we're dealing with when it comes to 7 to 10 days from now. Queen of Swords, Queen of the Ocean, Abundance, nice. Ace of Swords crossroads and then we have seven of cups i wanted to pull one more let's do it four of pentacles and stability strength okay so i do see for some of you you're going to be dealing with someone who is very straight to the point someone who doesn't bullshit and this is going to be someone who will be very important to you when it comes to seven to ten days from now 
I would pick up the energy of yours because that's your reading, guys, from the first card, but not today, though. It feels like whoever this person is, they will be very influential to you. They will, you will hear some kind of a secret or they will give you some kind of information that you haven't thought of before. Okay, look how these vibe together. This queen will hand, hand the sword for you and say, you know what, it's, it's your time now. Whoever this queen is to you, it seems like she's very experienced and she's like, I'm handing you my sword now, it's your time to go. It's your time to accomplish everything. So some of you, I'm hearing legacy of some sorts. Um, legacy is being passed over. For some of you, uh, yeah, this queen is handing her sword. She's saying, speak your words, speak your truth, go out there and be visible to the world. Because it seems like she, she's like, I've done enough. I've done enough. Butterflies are important for some of you. Flamingo never picked, up, picked it up uh, before, so maybe for some of you that's important too. Now, there's going to be also a person who is very fertile, okay, when it comes to the seventh, ten days. And it seems like some of you will be, you'll find this person very attractive somehow. Whoever this person is, um, I feel that sex appeal from your side towards them and you might be at the crossroads saying i don't know what i should do when it comes to this person i feel like um i've been holding on to yeah i've been holding on to my emotions and to what i have to put out and say towards this person to this person for too long and now it's my time to release everything for a lot of you you are releasing a lot of emotional burdens too and that's going to help you out a lot someone is releasing someone i'm hearing someone is releasing someone from their life okay and it seems like whatever was happening for you or will be happening for you pile number two this is saying uh it's time to make a choice when it comes to your stability you will be making some kind of a choice here with the seven of cups and the four of pentacles you might start wanting to save money for a specific for one specific thing. Saving money is very important here. And really choosing which cup you wanna pick when it comes to seven of cups. What do I wanna do next? You have released someone or something in your life here that has made you somehow much stronger than you were before. This is gonna be very empowering for you. Whatever has happened or will happen for you guys, it, it will make you double. It will make you twice stronger. Um, and you it might not feel that way right now, but it will in the future for you guys. And whatever the situation when it comes to your own finances, I'm feeling someone, that's probably for one of you, someone has bought a new wallet or someone has bought something red. So whoever you are here, this is saying it's your time now to start making a choice when it comes to something that's very important for you. Let's see what it is. It's closely connected to creativity and living the life of... Hmm, living a life full of imagination when it comes to your own craft. So whatever the... Uh, creativity you have in you this is saying you have to put it out there into the world otherwise the world won't see you and someone has a cat here for sure Bl black cat or if not black um it might it might have green eyes i'm hearing okay so whoever you are and someone has a vase full of flowers not far from them but don't think that those flowers are real for some of them Someone has probably a fake bouquet of flowers somewhere. I don't know why I'm picking this up. It's not for all of you, obviously. So some of you will vibe with this. And um, whoever wants to start doing some kind of creative endeavors or painting or um, your own business of some sort, if you do have one, this thing is going to be a good time to concentrate on that. Because whatever you, you are releasing or whoever you are releasing from your life, okay, you are being given this sword for a reason. You are being 
pass something over to you in order to make something happen. This is a very powerful week when it comes to that, guys, okay? So let me see how your emotional state or your soul state, as I like to call it, will be when it comes to this seven to 10 days from now. Surrender to the sweetness. Wow, what a vibe, guys. Venus energy, pleasure, joy, make love to life. It's all about making love to life, right? Look at these cards. Look how creative, how flowing these cards are. It's all about you stepping into this energy of a never-ending miracle somehow i don't know why guys but for some of you it's gonna make sense okay some of you will be connecting with some the opposite sex here or you will notice someone and appreciate someone from a different light than you had before and there is a spark happening between two people and it's very connected to that creativity that creativity will somehow put you on a different vibration where you'll start seeing yourself as much more sex sexy or appealing to other people too okay and you'll be like you know what i love myself i love how i look i love my hair i love my chest i love my arms i love everything about myself therefore you'll start getting appreciation from the opposite sex so don't be surprised if you'll if you'll have a lot of passion during these seven to ten days from now and this is saying surrender to the sweetness, to surrender to the love that life has to offer to you because there's going to be a lot of pleasure and joy and pro for some of you making love for sure. Okay, so I hope this made sense and I'm going to catch you next week. Bye for now. Hello, pal free people. So I'm starting today with uh, your current energies. I don't know why I've been drawn to tuning into your energies first before we go on and predict your seven to ten to ten days from now future. Okay, so let's see what we have here. What you're dealing with right now? Wow, we have karmic relationships, Orion energy, polarity, soul growth, conflict. Okay, let's see with my triple goddess tarot what else you are feeling and what else you are doing. Someone is walking away from a karmic connection here or has recently walked away and it feels like you feel very at ease. So there was some kind of connection in your life that you got away from. If not just yet, give it one or two days, okay? But this is saying whatever the connection you had, it has set you free somehow. And as, as I'm saying, set you free, the chariot pops out, right? You're moving away from someone. Wow, guys. Four of cups. Yeah, look at this. So it seems like you were not fulfilled in this connection for sure. You kept longing for someone who never really spend enough time or giving you enough time of theirs or giving you enough appreciation. Therefore, you're like, you know what? I feel like I need to release this karmic connection. For some of you, if it's not connection, this is talking about some kind of karmic situation in your life that you are running away from here okay so interpret this your own way because there are so many of you watching this some of you have gone to an actual reader and the reader has told you that girl or boy you know what i think it's time to move this is a karmic connection that's probably for one or two of, of you here now okay and uh it seems like whatever the case your karmic depth when it comes to this situation is done and over with so there is the longing and the conflict in your head and your emotional state is coming to an end here, guys. You are becoming someone else here. Take a look at this card. This person is becoming someone else. They are involved in. And some of you have felt this all along. You didn't need a reader to tell you that. Probably some of you who does 
tarot for yourself you have seen that in card but maybe you didn't want to believe it or it's something about not seeing it clearly at one point but then bang we have this understanding that came out of nowhere and you're like oh my god why didn't didn't i see the situation from the get-go um and there is no more i'm hearing no more so whatever the situation you are done and over with some kind of karmic scenario here okay so i'm really stoked for pile number threes because you are onto a new adventure here of some sorts right let me see now what we're dealing with seven to ten days from now we have the tower we have the partnership right right for those who haven't gone through this i told you well i told you and this tower guys don't be afraid of this tower because this tower is super creative and this tower i love this tower look there are flowers there is um lightning bolts in here that for me it makes and there is an owl in the very middle over there can you see that someone is wise enough to let something go to let something go right wow pile number threes wow yeah and you're starting fresh i'm stoked for you you're starting fresh Yeah, this is saying it might be transformation. Well, makes sense. Uh, this is saying it might be sad. Whatever the situation you will be dealing with, for some of you, is not going to be only partnership. This is someone who... Um, whatever I said before, to, to one part of you guys, there is another scenario. Someone is letting someone go from their life and they're going to try not to... I'm hearing cry cry and cry again about this okay whatever has happened we have death here too uh, someone has released someone or someone has released something in their life that is making them very sad about it but intuitively this person knows that this is uh, not as bad as it seems five of cups this is saying I'm crying over spilled milk right making the situation much uh, more difficult for oneself than it really is and whatever the ending you have guys pile number three you're going to start fresh and this fresh start we're going to take a look at this is saying there is something that you felt intuitively already that will happen for you and whatever the transformation you will be going through it somehow will develop your powers guys i don't know why Whatever the ending, it's closely connected to your intuition. So if you did have any power to you until now, watch it becoming much, much more hyped for you. So your intuitive powers, your abilities, your vibration will be very high when it comes to these 7 to 10 days from now. Ooh, guys i'm gonna pull a couple of cards from the uh, from the envelopes here and let's see some extra messages guys i'm gonna try not to interpret them unless no they don't want to come out unless i feel otherwise okay what's up okay we have one popping we have one more and i need one more This is saying not now so if anyone has been thinking about should i do this now or later this is your answer okay we have divorce maybe some of you will, you are going through divorce right now or will be in the future and we have poor so look whoever feels like they don't have enough you have this opportunity in the future for yourself when it comes to divorce and not now not now is very specific for someone watching here so i'm gonna leave it with you divorce is saying this is happening here as you can see already like you see from the cards partnership and tower means something is going down but it doesn't have to be romantic here uh, things might be going down when it comes to connection in general okay but because it had to happen that way just let it flow let it happen naturally guys don't push it okay just try to 
look for this pentacle here this new fresh start let's see what that's talking about we have another <laughs> another some kind of fresh understanding here when it comes to um, material realm here let me shuffle these and i want to see what else we're talking about what is this new beginning that something is bringing or someone is bringing you okay let's see what we have you joking guys watch out for shit loads of opportunities okay look ace of pentacles ace of swords ace of wands which one do you want to pick do you want to start uh, the some kind of new endeavor fresh and grounded do you want to start it with uh, clarity do you need clarity do you need passion for life do you need to get back passion for life do you need sparkles so whoever needs what here you'll be getting that wow guys wow wow whatever the wish pile number three you're getting it granted someone wish that's very very important for you guys is being granted i'm hearing autumn time just for one or two of you that's somehow important now someone has a pendulum of some sorts that is round and has is probably very similar to what this girl have so i just wanted to put it out there if you felt drawn to buying a pendulum of some sorts i would say buy it it's going to help you out what kind of jewelry did you want to get recently only for those who did especially if it includes some kind of stone um would it have red or blue undertone for some of you yellow undertone i would say get it because it's gonna help you to get this quicker for yourself not mm, not only um this is gonna happen either way you get in these new beginnings either way do you want passion do you want clarity in life do you want stable money whatever it is you get in that but this is saying that it would help you throughout this journey of wanting of achieving that dream of yours okay whatever the piece of jewelry you are thinking about <laughs> wow guys okay i see a person i see a person there's going to be a person um who will be influential to you when it comes to seven to ten days from now this can be um queen of cups this is someone a very loving female a very loving female who probably is a little bit bound when it comes to her own thoughts and who's been going through a difficult emotional state okay so it might be you helping her or it might be her helping you okay so vice versa now it doesn't have to be a female i'm just getting a lot of female energy as you can see over here but it can also be male who is tuned at that time into his feminine energy okay but whatever the situation here it seems like someone is helping someone out someone is comforting someone else here okay and someone is giving that sparkle back in their life because it seems like someone has lost it someone has lost a spark in their life okay look at this how they feeling right now and whoever this person is they given this they at least they're trying to help this person somehow cope with whatever the situation here someone has health issues here but that's not you whoever this female is or was in the recent past for some of you has health issues and i think it might be you helping her or someone is, is helping her or it's just an exchange happening of some sorts um, when it comes to bringing that fire back in life, okay? But something has gone down here. Something has gone down that shook, shook foundation. Something has happened that was very like bang, you know? And um, whatever the situation here, it seems like... You're being guided somewhere, guys. You're being guided towards these new beginnings by some kind of force. This is a force. 
three of them in one reading, it's a force. Someone or something is guiding you towards your destiny. Towards a happier life. Some of you will have a very nice get together or communication with a friend of some sort. Celebration is coming through. Let's see what else we have here. Choices are being made. Travel plans are being made. Communication from overseas, from far away, right? Online communication here. We have Eight of Swords again. Let's see what that's talking about. Healing. Yeah, someone's going, someone got hurt and someone's going through the healing. Okay, so it could be you or it could be that person I talked about. And it's very cl closely connected again to this main energy here of some, some kind of connection crumbling down. Okay, so you and someone else is going parting ways here. But someone will need the, um, to concentrate on their mental health. And I feel like they will. It's not that they will be stuck in it for too long, but some kind of angel is coming in to help them and to do that healing, okay? This is someone, I told you, the four sent from above of some sorts. So, wow. <laughs> Pile number three. Thank you for those who are updating me when it comes to your future predictions and coming back and telling me what has happened actually. I love you for that. So I would really like to hear from pile number three what, what the heck will be happening because it's going to be a massive shift that you haven't, haven't gotten for a really long time, okay? And this is nothing scary. This is a lot of that. There's a lot of spiritual support. There's a lot of magical new beginnings come in here what is your dream this is saying i'm gonna take you there i'm gonna start this for you okay so i'm gonna love you and i'm gonna leave you until next time bye for now Hello pile number four people, whoever has chosen the last intuitive card over here. We're doing your reading and today I want to start with your current energies, okay? So let's see where you add emotionally, soul level. What's kind, what kind of soul vibration you are right now? So let's tune into you first before I continue to your seven to 10 days predictions. And I'm hearing someone's brother um, so if it's not your brother who is important to you right now, it's someone else's brother who will be important. Brotherly energy is very strong here. Wow. Yeah, would it be your, your friend whom you consider your brother? So that's somehow very, very important for you guys. I don't know what's happening or father energy here. And I see a star, a star in the sky. Okay, let's see what we have when it comes to our current energies. Wow, love this. Aquarcana hashtag here, <laughs> joking. <laughs> We've got the seas of Mintaka, seeing potential, bringing unconsciousness to light. Wow. I feel like I want one more card for you guys here. Wow, okay, did you hear that? It fell on the floor, but too many guys, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to shuffle again. For you, I somehow want one more card when it comes to your current energies. But whatever is happening here, it seems like you have, I'm hearing a fresh breath of air. You know, someone goes like, oh, you know, and it's just very nice. It's just very nice. Yeah, it makes sense. Because you shifting from, you know when I've done that, so you releasing the darkness from your life. Whatever. And do you remember how I said I saw a star, right? 
and it says stop embrace winter great cosmic womb this is saying stop and take time to embrace the darkness that has happened here because whatever has happened or is happening to you right now on emotional or a physical level for some of you uh, this is this is very strong this is very strong okay this is saying hey whatever the situation look at that water look at the difference between the two you are becoming someone who was very different in the past two weeks so you're shifting from that darkness to the to the light Emotional healing, emotional healing. I keep hearing that, okay? Emotional healing. Let's see what's up. We have the full. And I feel like panel number two, I don't know if I'm gonna finish with editing or working on my Etsy, but I'm working on my mom's listings that I'm gonna add to my Etsy shop. And, um, I'm not advertising her for you because she's my mom. Someone needs emotional or physical healing that I know only my mom could handle. And I'm actually, funny fact, I was about to go and finish this, this list, these listings for, for her. Um, she would be doing two different sessions. So whatever, if you would, if you would want to, because someone really needs that here. Um, she does two different things one session is for emotional healing but like you know difficult things really um and the other one is for physical so the physical healing that she does i don't think i've seen you know i'm in i'm in this field so i see how miracles happen and stuff and how magic is really how magical life is but i've never seen people heal so quickly and they heal when she's connected to them. I mean, it's just amazing. And she, she did that once on actually this Friday. She did it on my friend who is very um, logic and intellect driven, right? This person is not someone who really believes in that stuff, but she couldn't move. She was sitting at her desk, I'm working with her. She couldn't move her neck and her shoulders at all she was like i cannot move it's been like so long now that i can't take this pain away and uh, my mom called her <laughs> she said do this and that blah 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 they had a convo and she comes back to my desk 20 minutes later looking at me scared saying i feel nothing anymore there is no pain there's a relief so there is the relief for you that's happening right now of some sort or will be in the near future. Yeah, look, the water is very important here. Whatever the emotional healing, guys, whew, you have gone through it. And I'm hearing this wasn't fair. So someone is dealing with some situation that isn't fair, some kind of risk is being thought of over here something is risky uh discovering going back to childhood childhood memories are coming through here uh whatever the healing that has to be done here it's very deep and i think you're concentrating on that now what what is it that i need to go next okay show me the way i'm hearing show me the way oh my god and i'm hearing the song It's called Show Me How to Live by, okay, one second. Wow, guys, by number three. Show, the, the vocalist is um, deceased now, but I love, love them so much. One second, guys, I'm trying to find it now. By Audio Slave. I, it's so embarrassing that I don't, didn't remember uh, the name of a band. Audio Slave show me how to live please listen to that song something in the lyrics lyrics for you here that is needed for your current situation okay okay let's continue with your future predictions guys wow that was an in intense one pile number four 
let's see let's see what's up i have pre-shuffled these decks let's see what we're dealing with okay have the chariot i want to put these two together though okay makes sense and we have the four of cups and we have the anxiety here okay so look what's up here guys for you um you will have to put your life a little bit on hold pile number four in order to see from a different perspective you're gonna see life from a different perspective seven to ten days from now that's it full stop and you will have to allow yourself that time so don't rush take it easy self-care don't put pressure on yourself to perform don't try to be someone who's taking care of everyone else's business don't try to be someone who makes th things happen for yourself and for others the saying stop stop running okay take time for yourself really take time for yourself here because that's what you are need that you are needing right now rest rest and really take time for yourself and you will it seems like whatever the situation here, um, there's going to be some kind of love connection that is... So someone is traveling or wanting to travel towards someone else here. And that love doesn't necessarily have to be romantic. For some of you, it will be. Someone is bored of something, okay, that has happened or had enough, I'm hearing. I, I can't stand this anxiety. This is too much for me, blah, 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 blah. Can I see you? Someone wants to see someone here, okay, when it comes to seven to ten days from now. Mm -hmm. It seems like um, for you or for this other person, there is a bit too much happening. There is a bit of chaos. And therefore, this other person or you want to see this other person, right? Yeah, needing for balance. And you know that this person can bring you that balance. And this is probably someone you, you communicate with very well and you could collaborate even on projects of some sort. Someone saying, hey, there is too much competition in my own head. I'm a bit bored of something. Can I see you? Because you bring me that balance, you bring me that need of collaboration, this inspiration of some sort. I need you to inspire me, okay? Wow. Yeah, something has happened where someone has walked away from someone's life here. Someone will walk away from someone's life, okay? So take what resonates. And whatever the uh, situation here we have, that's caused someone anxiety. And someone is seeking for comfort when it comes to this other person. Someone is comforting you or you are comforting them. Told you, told you, right? Just look at this connection here. Look how comfortable this um, connection is. I'm sorry, it's not focused, is it? No. How comfortable. There, there are sheets. It seems like um, they're very in, in a very cozy place. Everything is very sweet and very lighthearted. There is warmth coming through here. And someone needs comforting when it comes to sev seven to ten days from now. So seek for comfort, guys, if it's you. If it's not you, someone will be coming towards you saying, hey, you know, can we chat? Or, hey, um, I know I've been distant, right? Are you okay to talk now? Because I've been very anxious about something that has happened. Everything was on hold here, right? And now it's time to reconnect. Now it's time to collaborate again. Some, some kind of collaboration. Might be connected with work, equal give and take, equal um, give and take when it comes to connection or when it comes to work. <laughs> someone is building their legacy here. So someone is building legacy with someone else or this other person is helping to help build legacy for someone. This thing, hey, they are both... I mean, look at this card. Uh, they're both in this together. And this is saying, I'm thinking about this house or this legacy that we can build together. And whatever the legacy is going to last forever. It's going to last for the generations to come. I want to leave something behind me. This is saying, okay. 
someone really needs a connection of some sort when it comes to seven to ten days from now and again there's competition coming through but not in this card i don't see it in this card that way i don't read it that way i read it as if someone has very strong powers right when it comes to their own self some kind of abilities that might be somehow influential here i'm not sure for some of you it will be and for some of you this is um an older person or for some of you this is someone who doesn't bullshit and doesn't sugarcoat things i'm gonna tell you how it is i'm gonna tell you how it is yeah very much um money and connect and connection so it's all about money and connection seven to ten days from now someone wants to build legacy with someone start saving money for the house start saving money for themselves for their future kids um, someone has walked away from someone here. Someone is seeking for this very stable, stable connection. Someone needs love. Someone really needs comforting and love when it comes to seven to ten days from now. And therefore, they come towards this other person to seek for that. But not from the egoistic way. Okay, it's going to be very, very nice. Very lighthearted. Whew. Let's pull a couple of cards from my envelopes and I'm going to try not to interpret them. I'm going to leave these messages with you. So some of you might be going through this now or it means something to you now or you will see that it will mean something to you when it comes to 7 to 10 days from now. Um, no, not that one, that one. <laughs> okay, and that one wants to pop out new offer okay not interested and park some of you might reject an offer it seems here <laughs> but anyway um when you look at these cards this is very individual for each of you okay so whoever has been waiting for an offer you get in it this is saying new offer is coming your way so whatever is on your mind right if you wanted to spend more time in nature or ground yourself this thing that's gonna happen for sure if you wanted to travel to a place that has a lot of nature to it it's gonna happen not interested it's very personal i'm not gonna try to interpret it because i feel like one or two of you are like i knew it kind of thing so i'll leave it with you okay but i'm gonna see you next week pile number four and best of luck